Today has been a major go with the flow day. Yeah. Oh. We're gonna miss the train. see it, which is an Interlochen. So we're getting on this train, which leaves in a few minutes. And it'll take us about an hour to get there. Why does it say it on the train? Are you beautiful? Okay, so... Ready? Okay. We lost our passport. Bob Sar. Neo, how do you feel that you can't leave Neo's passport? Yes. Have you been yesterday in one of our, our meeting rooms? In the meeting room, so over there where the reception This is where was. we lost it. Oh my over goodness, here. okay, yes, sounds good. Okay, thank you, have a good Thank day. you. It looks like some Roman architecture here. It's very classical kind of architecture. Neo and I got Rivella, which is a native Swiss drink. It's a milk-based product, although it looks a lot like Sprite. It's very good, so we're going to be trying out this new brownish flavor. Yeah, we accidentally put in the wrong burn station. So uh, the next train's at 12.04. Yeah, we Irish. should be there by one o'clock and then we'll start interlocking day. Right now we're at Thune Castle, we just entered, and we're gonna go up the stairs and take a look around. This is a Roman column, and they would use them for road markers, so it would tell you how far it was since the last column. They took these and they put these into churches and monasteries here, and reused them because they were so unique. In the olden days, there was a mayor. He's responsible for the police, the judiciary, and the military. He's elected by a board of Bernese ruling families, which is kind of similar to an oligarchy, and it's, in my opinion, pretty abusive. One of these crimes is gang robbery, and another one that I picked up is beating with a birch and lifelong servitude in a galley ship in Genova. Basically, if they weigh the same, that means that you matched the punishment to the crime correctly, like they would have done. We are actually in the Knights Hall in Dude Castle, which is actually one of the most well-preserved halls in all of Switzerland. And if you look at the ceiling, actually, there are 26 pine wood beams that support the ceiling. But if you look closely, I mean, they're almost completely black. And the reason for that is back in the 12th century, 12th, 13th, 14th century, they would actually use oxen blood to get that blackish color. Now, if you look at this wall here, you can see that there's actually a clear split between the two types of materials. This is actually plaster compared to this part, which is stone, because during the 14th century, there was a huge transition in Switzerland towards Gothic architecture, which can be seen here with this very typical ochre color of plaster. Boone 
castle has four distinct towers and it dates back from 1200. It's a testimony to the architecture of the Dukes of Zaringen and it's an architectural beauty in the town of Thun because you were able to see the mountains, the lake, and the town with a 360 degree parallel view all around you. The towers are up there. So we What's just up, finished Kenny? coming from Thune Castle. We toured it, we got to see the Knights Hall and we got to see the courtyard and everything. The well was really cool. Right now we're headed along Thune River and then we're gonna head down to Thune Lake after we grab some lunch. So. going to the train station to try and catch a train from Thun, where we are right now, all the way back to Zurich, but it canceled at the last minute, so we have to wait half an hour in order to get a train there. So we're gonna grab some food and party. Let's go. We just got back from going out to Thun, uh, and now we're headed back to the hotel. Hopefully, um, hopefully we'll be able to eat a nice dinner with meals on if that goes as planned. Um, maybe also hit up a Migros along the way, and then go to sleep. I don't know how to say it, so. Headed back to the hotel. Gonna go get some dinner, hopefully, some soon, and then get some go, 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 good. Go, go, go. Get some good things. <laughs> 